What's going on with trucking junkies? It's raining. A lot. Good thing, uh, good thing, uh, you can do all your stuff on the inside. That package. Man. Let's go get loaded. We made it. Man, was it raining. Holy cow. Got here, got right in. Must be a slow day today, or at least I hit it at the right time. We'll put it that way. Oh. We get loaded up. I guess it's going to depend on the, the wife. She want, might want me to stick around the Little Rock area and just drive her home. She doesn't like driving in all this rain and stuff. I don't know. We'll see. I'll give her a call when I'm done and see what she wants me to do. If not, I'm going straight home then. Green light go. Let's go. Turn that off. Speaking of that, so I've saved up enough pilot points to get me a new CB. Uh, I'm gonna give this one back to my dad. I've had it. I've had it since I've, you know, started driving. But uh, it needs to be tuned. This one needs to be tuned. It needs an it needs an external antenna too, because it doesn't reach very far. It gets a lot of static, that kind of stuff. That's mainly why I don't keep the thing on. It's noisy. Uh, but I went into Pilot in Russellville to get me one, and they had one that I wanted, or they, you know, they I found the one I wanted. They go back there and look. They don't have it. So I'll just have to wait. No big deal. Just continue to use this one. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Let me get out and do some work. Well, we got one on already. Here comes the other one. Then we'll get our securement on, tarps on, get out of here. Got enough room? Sweet. And she's down. Should be a one tarper. Sweet. All right. Well, the water resistance of this Scotch Guard I sprayed on here is going to get tested today, it looks like. Uh, and you see this right here? While I'm at home, this this hinge, this piano hinge, all the rivets came out of the out of the uh, truck. See how the diamond plate and stuff? So I'm going to drill holes. I've got some self-tapping screws. I'm going to drill the holes in here, well, in here to get that plate back onto the diamond plate so that this won't come off like it. They've all ripped out. It's, been, it's become a pain in the butt, so i got to get it fixed. Whoo, the wind feels good. Because it is hot in here. It's getting hot in here. So take off all your clothes. I am getting too hot. I'm gonna take my clothes off. No, I'm not. 
Nobody wants to see that. <clears throat> Anybody out there like Nelly? I like me some Nelly. Ludicrous. How's it going? Doing all right? Doing pretty good. Hey, yep. Uh, well, what are you? Where are you going? Louisville. So you're gonna get one coil. Uh, you're just gonna need to set up your coil rack. However, y'all set it up, huh? Well, that's how I do it. I've got. We've got. I've got a 4x4 here, a beveled one, and a 4x4 on the other side. Okay. And then I've got my coil racks, you know, them sitting on the coil rack. Do you guys use uh, coil pads and stuff? Uh, those rubber yeah, those rubber yeah, things. Those. Yeah, lay you two of those down after you get your coil rack set up and everything. Then you're ready to go. Okay. Yeah, pretty easy. Yeah, they only get... That, that rental's usually for flatbedders. We only get like one for that place. Yeah. You ever been there? Now, it's uh, you got a truck GPS or just uh, what's on your Qualcomm? Okay, so it's gonna send you probably close to them, but you're probably last last mile. You're probably gonna have to look it up on Google because they're they take up about two city blocks, and and the street that they're actually on is a one-way street back the other way. So you kind of have to go down a one-way street and then turn and then turn and then actually get to them. It's it's a pain. <laughs> yeah, man, no worries. <laughs> battery ran out just as I was getting in the truck to move there she is one tarp will do you we got two green tarps on it one uh, black tarp these guys that do these lumber tarps man I don't know if they've just never tried it or what but Man, I don't touch those lumber tarps unless I absolutely have to. Because I don't like them. They're too heavy. Yeah, 
strut. Oh yeah, that red strap. Yeah. Yeah. It looked like it's a good strap. Yeah. You want it? No. I, I, <laughs> I got bunches of them. <laughs> All right. Oh. Well, fellas, there she is. She's just like a hot mom after a divorce. All dressed up and ready to go. Mm. So you know what I say about that? Let's go.